all right hello everybody welcome back to a brand new video on my channel now in today's video i'm going to show you guys how to create a minecraft server in 2025 now i know there's a lot of you guys out there that are trying to create a server and be like the next high pixel or just the next big minecraft server and in today's video i'm going to go ahead and give you guys a full guide on how you guys can achieve that goal so now what i'm going to go ahead and do is i'm going to go ahead and get on our desktop and i'm going to show you guys how you guys can actually create your minecraft server so boys what you guys want to go ahead and do is on chrome you guys want to go ahead and type in the website novacorehosting.com now guys this hosting is a brand new hosting and you guys know with brand new hosting comes very cheap prices so as you guys can see on this hosting they show you guys literally everything that they have they have you know very good hardware so your server does not lag they have good ddos protection as you guys can see they even have local us network with very low latency then as you keep scrolling right here it tells you it's built for performance optimized for gaming and it gives you guys even more of the features and how reliable they are then if we scroll down here it shows you guys how their control panel looks and this is how their control panel looks looks like but you guys do have your server running which i'll go ahead and show you guys in just a bit because i actually have a server of my own so i'm able to go ahead and show you guys how to actually play the server hop on the server and do everything with the server now as we keep scrolling right here they give you more features basically telling you guys that they have real-time monitoring advanced console file management database access if we keep scrolling right now they only have north america and they have it in dallas and it seems like they only right now have north america and dallas as of right now because as it again this hosting is brand new so they don't have a lot of locations yet and then right here is telling you guys to go ahead and go over to your game servers and they even have a free trial that you'll be able to claim very soon which i've never seen no hosting do this before of being able to get a free trial on a hosting that's actually very cool and then as you keep scrolling right here you guys even have a help section where you guys can go in and get all the help you guys get you know common questions if you guys want to go ahead and you know answer any questions they have game server questions dedicated service questions right here so join their discord get support and then contact them now as we go ahead and scroll up and hover over games boys they actually support minecraft and gary's mod which is so cool so if we go in and click on minecraft right now and scroll down as you guys can see super super cheap boys so right here four gigabyte plan is literally ten dollars a month you guys can go in and choose this plan this is everything you guys will get right here is the six gigabyte plan which is fifteen dollars a month eight gigabyte plan which is twenty dollars a month if we keep scrolling twelve gigabyte plan thirty dollars a month sixteen gigabyte plan forty dollars a month and then the thirty two gigabyte plan is eighty dollars a month which is super super cheap in my opinion boys now if we even go to the gary's mod if you guys do play gary's mod right here so cheap the starter is $25 a month and this is everything you're getting with it the community is $40 a month with all of this and then the maximum $60 a month with all of these insane features which is super dope then lifetime start is $40 for one time literally just one draws one time and look out everything you're getting lifetime is 640 that's everything you're getting and then lifetime maximum is 960 and this is everything you guys are getting and they have a whole bunch of FAQ questions for Gary's mod right here too boys so if you guys do play Gary's mod you guys can get a server for from here too now right here is the resources if you guys want to go in and click on knowledge right here you guys can go and enter any questions that you guys you know want to ask about the hosting and then you guys can go ahead and search and see if there's any articles found for it which is so dope then right here is their status page so you guys can see if you know their servers are up and as you guys can see everything is functional and all of it is up boys and then right here is obviously their support where you guys can even email and phone call them which is insane by the way then obviously they have their discord community and support ticket and then help categories right here too boys now what i'm going to go in and do is i'm going to go over to the game panel right now and this is how their game panel looks so when you guys do buy a server you guys will be brought up to their panel and this is exactly how their panel is going to look like now as you can see this is my server that i have right here as you guys can see i have the console file manager access right here startup perimeters right here the system server details sftp details audit logs management databases so you guys can create databases backup sub users allocations configuration right here too and then we also have tools right here so as you guys can see you guys basically have your entire server now you are probably wondering well how do i actually join the server so what you want to go ahead and do is you guys want to go ahead and start up your server now once you guys start up your server you guys have to wait for it to install everything and once it's installed everything you guys will then be able to go ahead and play so let's just go ahead and accept the eula and let's just wait for our server to turn on right now and just like so my server is now on now you guys are probably wondering well how do i join it well this ip that you have right here you guys just want to go ahead and copy it click on minecraft go to multiplayer add server put the ip in and then scroll down and just like so this would be your server now currently i'm on the wrong version of minecraft so let me just quickly hop on 1.21.10 now as i'm on 1.21.10 i'm now going to be able to join the server and just like so joining world let's give it one more second and i am now in my server boys now you guys are probably wondering well how do i add plugins and how do i get up on the server what you guys want to just simply go ahead and do is just type in op Zayas, just like so and there we go i'm now up and i'm able to go in and do like game with creative and things like that and just be able to do anything that i want in my server now to add plugins to your server is pretty self-explanatory depending on your spigot version and depending on what version of minecraft you guys are playing you guys are able to 
add plugins into your server since i am currently on the newest version of minecraft and the spigot that we seem to be using doesn't seem to support plugins as you can see i don't have a plugins folder but when you guys do use a different spigot and depending on the spigot that you guys use you guys will have a plugins folder where you guys are able to go ahead and add any plugins that you guys want so yeah guys i think you guys should all go ahead and check out this hosting in the description below this hosting is extremely reliable and especially if you guys are looking for a way to make a minecraft server this will definitely be the go because as you guys can see the server's not laggy at all it's been smooth it has not had no crashes yet at all and overall the server is running perfectly fine so overall if you guys are looking for a way to make your minecraft server i definitely think you guys should check out this hosting but other than that boys i hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you guys did make sure you guys hit the subscribe button like and comment and other than that boys i'll catch you on the next video peace out